after more than two years of gang violence, deadly clashes and brutal kidnappings in Haiti, international troops now being called to intervene. 13 votes in favor. The draft resolution has been adopted. Tonight, the United Nations voting to send military force to stabilize the country. Gangs currently controlling over 80 percent of the country's capital, Port-au-Prince, according to the U.N., who has called the status quo a catastrophic spiral of violence. The vote allowing for a non-U.N. force to provide support to Haiti's national police for at least a year in hopes of regaining control of critical infrastructure like the airport, ports and roads. The African country of Kenya willing to lead the charge. We'll also be training the Haiti police uh, so that they can have their numbers so that we go, we finish our mission, we come back, we leave them with a stable country. The Kenyans now have the authorization that they needed to collect this posse, if you will, and, and put them all together and start to form uh, the force that will go forward uh, and and conduct business in Haiti. So it's, uh, it's the green light that they've needed. The vote comes a year after the country called on the UN for help. Since then, the Security Council has imposed sanctions on some of the most powerful gang members, including Jimmy Barbecue Cherizet.